Hello and thanks for watching this Cloud9 ERP Solutions video and subscribing to our channels. In this video, we're going to show you how to change a purchase order. So here's a purchase order. It's set to open. And the correct workflow in Acumatica is that if it's open, that means the vendor knows about it. Now, you don't see any activities here, but typically it would be emailed out to the vendor. And you'd see it under activities. You might see a conversation going on here. But Acumatica locks this down, so we can't make changes until we put the purchase order back on hold. This is to ensure that you're properly communicating with the vendor. You're not just changing the purchase order to a different quantity, and then the vendor ships you the original products and quantities from the original order before you changed it. So in order to make a change, certainly you would want to contact the vendor and let them know that you're going to make a change and to hold the purchase order. And is it okay to make a change? But in Acumatica, we would put it on hold once we have that confirmation. We can come in here, change our quantities if we need to. We can also delete quantities here. Keep in mind that Acumatica shows us how much of this order has been received. So if this is an ongoing purchase order and we have back orders, we'll flick the screen right now and show you what that looks like. So now here's that same purchase order. It's open. And the vendors sent us three of this second line item. All the other items are open. So let's say, for example, we wanted to make a change here. Maybe we're satisfied with the three we don't need anymore. So what we could do here is we could scroll over to the right, and you'll notice there's three checkboxes. And these checkboxes give you actions of what you can do. So this top line item, I could cancel it if I want to. Or I can close it. The other line items, for example, I can cancel. I scroll over to the right and hit save. I've now canceled these items. Now, this is to say that if I really wanted to make a change to this so that I can communicate to the vendor, what I might want to do is put this back on hold and make all the changes. So if I do that, I could instead send them another purchase order and delete these line items. But now that we've closed this line, meaning we don't want the six, we were happy with just the three, and we canceled this line item, if we go to enter a purchase order receipt, we go to receive this, notice you only have these two lines. The one line, we're okay with the three instead of the six quantity, so it's not going to be receivable. And then the other line that we canceled is no longer there. So we're left with the balance of these two items. Lastly, what you can do is you can mark this as complete or cancel. So if we were to mark this as complete order, now this purchase order is complete and nothing can be received from this purchase order. You might want to throw a note in here to say, spoke to the vendor and confirmed we received all we needed. Or additionally, you could send them an email on this purchase order. So that's modifying a purchase order. Canceling, completing, modifying quantities of line items. If you have any questions about this or anything else Acumatica, feel free to reach out to us. We'd love to hear from you. Thanks again and for clicking the like button and have a great day.